Now at 6, 9-11 remembered. Thousands came to see a beam from the World Trade Center as it passed through Angola today. Good evening. I'm Alyssa Ivinson. The beam was on display last night and this morning before heading to its permanent home in Elkhart County. News Channel 15's Megan Royce shows us what the event means to those who were there to see the piece of history. You could hear the heartbeat of America as thousands of Patriot Guard riders made their engines roar. There were mixed emotions as people walked up and even touched this beam from the World Trade Center. Very overwhelming. It's a bit over, overwhelming. Sadness for all the loss. Some say being able to witness this piece of history is something they'll never forget. Today's special for me because I spent a lot of time at, at the World Trade Center when this happened. Just thinking of all the people that had died there. Needed to see it. Others describe their thoughts and emotions when they saw the beam for the first time. It brings a lump to your throat when you look at that little hunk of steel laying on that truck and what it represents and what has happened. And then you see the people rally around to not let it be forgotten. They weren't forgot, and a part of them, I think, is etched into that beam and will always remember it. I could just feel my heart start pounding. And you just try and bite back the tears because you, you've cried already so much, you don't want to cry again. Some believe being able to see the beam allows the healing process to continue. It's filling that little hole, part of that hole inside. It just, it's a start. The beam is now on its way to Oslo where it will be put into a permanent memorial. Reporting from Angola, Megan Royce, News Channel 15. The beam will be placed by the Oslo Fire Department. Right now, the city's still working on collecting donations, and they don't know when they'll start building the memorial just yet.